conditioning not just a problem at Odessa Court, but also at prisons statewide. Right now, 70% of Texas prisons don't have air conditioning. According to the Texas Department of Criminal Justice, only 30 of the 109 prison units in the state are fully air conditioned. Austin civil rights lawyers are fighting to change that, claiming conditions are inhumane, not only for the inmates, but also the prison staff. You know, and because you're basically living in that heat all of the time, day in and day out, and you really have to attend to the needs of these people. That's what the Constitution requires. That's what should be required of the uh, TDCJ. A TDCJ spokesman would not comment on the pending litigation, but told us, quote, the well-being of staff and offenders is a top priority for the agency, and we remain committed to making sure that both are safe during the extreme heat. The spokesman also said many of the prisons were built before time that air conditioning was commonly installed and that retrofitting facilities with AC would be extremely expensive. Here in Midland, the closest TDCJ prisons are in Fort Stockton, which does have AC, and Colorado City, which does not.